Hi, welcome to Data Wheels. My name is Istaba, and in this video, we will learn about how to create a gauge chart. Gauge chart is also known as a speedometer chart because it is like an speedometer. We we have seen a speedometer, and we can we have seen that there is a pointer also there, which shows that where exactly the speed is. So this is almost look like an speedometer. That's why we also says it as a speedometer. This is being used uh, for single KPI. Like we have some sales target and there is an achievement. So there are just two things: KPI and the actual achievement. So we can use in this only. This is not an inbuilt chart in Excel, as you can uh, see here. There is nowhere we can find this. We need to create it uh, by manipulating some data. So basically, we are using two different charts that is known as uh, pie chart and donor charts. So before proceeding fur further, we first need to understand how we will make this chart. So. <laughs> You can see that I have put four different values here. So in this, in my scenario, I have hundred as a final achievement. That is the maximum score that that guy can achieve. So I have put hundred, and there are three different more uh, categories that will show that if I will from zero to twenty five here, then it means that I am in red. If I am further 50, miss uh, 0 to 75, miss 25 to 75, I will be in yellow. And then further 75 to 100, I will be in green. That is these uh, numbers. You can change it as per your own requirement. There will be another uh, input data that is known as values. That is actually what we have achieved. And there's a pointer. Pointer says that how uh, the width of this pointer will be. And the final, the end point will be this sum of these. That means 200 minus value minus pointer. So now let's go and we will try to make this speedometer or gear chart. First, we will go in the insert tab, then we will go to the donor chart. Here, we will first remove the color, means no fill for the half part, then we will move the angle. So, angle of the first slice is 270. Now, it has been moved, but the width is very less. To increase the width, we will first go here and move the value as 50. Now it shows something good. Now first, the first point will be, first category will be of red color. So we will go here and solid fill and we will change the color as red. Now the next as solid fill and it is yellow and the third is a solid fill and that is red okay so the semi arc is ready that is the speedometer now we need to put our pointer here to create a pointer we first change some data so we will go in the select data and then add first in the series name we will put pointer and then the series values we will select all three different values okay so now it is created now one more thing we need to do we need to change the ch chart type so here there is the chart type so we will this pointer will be uh, change to pie chart and we will select as secondary axis. Now, the first piece 
we will fill no fill we will select just first piece of this pie chart and we will fill no fill then second and again no fill lastly this pointer remains here so before moving this pointer we will change the color or we can do yes solid and the color should whatever you want it black is good and the last thing we will do we will go in this series option and then we will change the angle as 270 okay so now this is ready just move some values here and there So this chart is ready you can change the pointer value as two to look it more beautiful and now you can change the values 90 whatever 